Hi everyone, it's Brick's 10th day birthday and he's looking super cute and this outfit he's wearing is really special. I got it when I was 19, so many, many years ago. Many moons ago. Yes. <laughs> And uh, when I bought it, I actually bought it in a package. One of my uh, good friends, she had her first son, but I saw it had my softball number. I was number eight when I played softball in high school, and I was like, well, heck, I wanna keep it if I ever have a baby. So of course I kept it for many, many years, tucked in a box, and now I finally get to use it. So I'm super excited that Brick is to wear it. And um, yeah, and then today, um, he got to meet his great-grandparents, the Millers, for the first time, which was really cool. So I went over there with Brick and my mom and my two nieces and my brother was there too because my brother um, was so nice. He changed the oil on our car for us, which was really cool. And it's funny because there was actually a rainstorm that came in that afternoon and he finished it right before that rainstorm happened, which I'm really happy or he would have been trenched. <laughs> and... Um, so yeah, Brick got to meet his grandparents. My grandma um, got to hold him for a long time. She fed him and super excited. And then also so cute because my four month old niece, Mason, I'm sorry, not Mason, Quinn, she just kept staring at Brick while my grandma was holding him because my mom was holding uh, Quinn. And she just kept staring at him. And then she would start doing baby talk. Like she was waiting for uh, Brick to say something back. But of course, Brick was just like milk drunk <laughs> from, my, uh, from my breast milk. And he was just like, whatever, but it was so cute because I know they'll be best of friends and cousins when they get bigger and bigger because they're only four months apart. And then it was so cute too because Quinn's very um, interested in uh, Brick as well. And um, she'll kind of go up to him and she's like, look, there's two babies. Like she's super excited about him. And she'd look at him when he cried or she'd look at him when he smiled. So she's very intrigued with Brick as well, probably because she just had a baby sister. So yeah, so it went really good at my grandparents' house. Um, my grandpa got to see him, my grandma got to finally see him, and then my aunt, one of my aunts got to see him too. And uh, I, I could tell when Michael texted me and said, oh, my family's coming over. My grandma did not want to let him go because she held him for a really, really long time. And uh, she, I was like, I'll bring him back, don't worry. So, and this is her, I believe she told me this is her 11th great-grandchild, which is pretty exciting for them. I hope I'm right. I believe it's 11, because she did tell me when I was over there, so hopefully I remember correctly. So, yeah, and then after that, Michael said, oh, my family's coming over, you gotta come back. And I was actually waiting for the downpour, because I didn't want to take Brooke out there, raining super hard. And so I came back, and then... Uh, Michael's mom and stepdad Ted came over and they brought us food, macaroni grill, which is funny because I've never eaten there. Have you? I've never eaten there either, but it was really good. Yeah, we both got the Parmesan Parmesan sandwiches. That's what we got. Yeah, so we got the Parmesan sandwiches and they were super good. And uh, of course, his stepdad got to hold him. I don't think Ted's hold, held him yet, right? That was his first time. That was his very first time he got to hold Brick because at the hospital it was kind of crazy because I had him kind of late at night and then uh, Michael's mom rocked him and held him for a little bit and then I had to change his diapers about three times when she was holding him <laughs> about three times it was three times that's hilarious yeah. <laughs> they were here for like an hour and he uh, we changed his diaper three times in one hour but he really does he tries to eat like once an hour so that those numbers add up. Yeah, he's getting bigger and bigger. He's getting more heavier. I mean, he's getting longer too. I wonder how much longer he is. So makes me wonder if I pushed him out on the 31st, <laughs> I would have been, <laughs> he probably would have been a C-section. <laughs> so yeah, I'm glad I had him on the 23rd because he wasn't that much. What is going on with his lips? His lips are still looking chapped. Yeah. What are, what are we going to do? How are we going to fix this lip situation? His poor little lips are still chapped to, um, from being in the Las Vegas weather and probably sucking on the bottle. So I'm definitely still um, putting coconut oil on it. Cause they're starting to, it's starting to peel off now. The dryness is peeling off. So they look a lot better than they have been. And his skin color looks better. So his, I can tell his jaundice levels are going down huge because you can see white with his blue eyes now. And that is just awesome, and I'm so happy, which by the way reminds me, I need to call that company to have them pick up the machine. 
because we're done with that. But um, yeah. So what did your grandma, or actually your grandma, his great grandma, what did she think about it? About brick? Yeah, like how how did she feel about holding brick, and what she what did she think about meeting brick for the first time? She was so excited. I brought him. She was so super excited because when I pulled up, it probably didn't look like it because my brother was right behind, and um. I was like, no, she's like, did you bring your baby? And I said, of course I did. And so it was so funny because I brought mine out and then Michael brings his baby out. And we put him on, because it was so nice outside, so we put the um, car seats on the grass. And she walked right up to him. She's like, oh my gosh, he's so cute. Oh, I can't believe he's here. She was so excited. She said she looked, he looked like both of us. Which I was like, okay. And then she kept, it's funny, because then she kept talking about my dad a lot. Because, you know, we got a boy. So she kept talking a lot about my dad when he was a baby, too. And she said he's such a good baby. Um, she fed him. She was so excited to feed him, hold him, burp him. <laughs> she loves babies. I think she's just excited, too, because... It's her 11th great, great grandbaby. So we're, us cousins, we just keep, we're producing. We're doing pretty good for the Miller family, so. <laughs> seasonal mating, ladies and gentlemen, Season, seasonal mating. Yes, because <laughs> he actually, my cousin has a baby that's eight months older than him. So it'll be so cute and when family reunions come around and they're a bit older and they can play, because I love playing with my cousins. So that was a lot of fun, but. How did your uh, grandfather ex uh, take the experience? Oh, he's funny. He loved it, too. He loves babies, and he thought he was so cute. Oh, he's so cute. That's the first thing he said. He's so little. I think because he was next to Quinn, and Quinn's like a, she looks like a football player right now. <laughs> She's such a chunkers. But, uh, yeah, he was really excited to see his uh, new grandson, new great-grandson. They love family. I know that. Oh, he's my little, little. Well, I know we had a storm, but do you think it will clear up enough where we can take a, a quick walk to the park before, before the sun comes down? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it got really nice outside, and it's not, um, it's not uh, as bad. So that sun's actually out right now. It's so weird. Vegas, you have storms that come through, and they maybe last for like five minutes, and they're gone. And it's funny, too, because sometimes through the valley, like Henderson, oh, we get rain. Vegas, oh, you don't get rain. There's certain parts. It's kind of funny. But at least the lake got rain. I'm always excited when it rains. So I'm like, oh, Lake Mead's filling up. But yeah, oh, and yesterday we did go to the park um, with my mom and my two nephews and niece. They actually met us at our apartment, and then we walked down together. And we all, Brick slept practically the whole time, but the other three kids went and played, and did their thing, had fun, and then they got super hot because it's Vegas, even though it was a nice day because we were probably in the shade. And they went home right after, and then me and Michael, we walked back home, and then I basically, like, I was, oh, and then I did work on our uh, nonprofit um, YouTube page, Aim High Smile. I've been working on that, so all those videos are uploaded. I just got them looking good. Yeah, just so everybody knows, uh, this is big news for us. We are officially a YouTube uh, nonprofit partner now. So YouTube is supporting us in our, in our community services towards uh, creating safe learning environments for children. So we're very excited of that, and we want to continue to grow our cause uh, through the relationships that we get through YouTube. Uh, that will be the Aim High Smile, ch Aim High Smile channel. Um, which is our parent uh, group for our, uh, our cause. And uh, so uh, in the future, please keep your eye out um, for uh, emails regarding Aim High Smile. Yes, absolutely. And then I got a call from Red Rock Elementary School today. We're supposed to go to a career day. Your son's been making faces. He's, he's making fa I don't know if it was a nightmare or if he's uh, leading up to uh, eating time, but he... But there was definitely a face that looked a little bit like he was uncertain. Oh no. Well, I will I'm prepared if he starts crying. So <laughs> But um yeah, Red Rock actually called us today. I need to call him back. I was gonna call him back tomorrow because we're gonna do career day with them in May. I believe, yes, in May. And uh, we're gonna bring Brick with us, so that'll be fun. That would be really cool. We can introduce him. Be like, listen, this is my career. When I grow up. I'm going to make a baby. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, I have to tell you a really funny story, really quick, that has to do with that. So, um, I have a buddy, uh, a church friend. I have a church friend, 
And uh, you know, this is a group of elite guys. We got doctors, we got lawyers, we got professional athletes, we got professional speakers. Everybody is just, you know, very, very successful, very wealthy neighborhood. And uh, it was a time where the, the, their children were supposed to go up on stage and kind of talk about what they wanted to do when they, uh, when they grow up. And you get these kids saying, I want to be an astronaut, I want to be the President of the United States. And my buddy, who's uh, uh, one of the most successful uh, people in the group, he's actually, he is um, a surgeon, uh, a brain surgeon, a plastic surgeon, a dentist. He, he deals with hardcore trauma. And so he went to school for like 25 years. It's insane, but he's fiercely, fiercely intelligent. Anyway, his son gets up there. He looks at the crowd and he says with a smile, and he's probably like uh, four or five years old. He looks at the crowd and he says, when I grow up, I want to be a stay at home dad. <laughs> and everybody just lost it, but that was funny. So yeah, I guess you could make a career out of it. Heck yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so it's been a uh, fun day, and then uh, today we're just keep going. Um, a lot of us have lack of sleep, but we're still going. We're still chugging along because, you know, we got to put our son first. We love our baby boy. And, uh, yeah, so everything's going good. Um, oh, and then I apologize if you see bumping with his bed. That's my knee on accident. <laughs> so sorry. But, uh, yeah, so thank you guys so much for listening. You guys are doing so awesome. Thank you again for the positive comments. Um, we really, really appreciate it. We love your love. It's a beautiful thing. Folks, remember, no matter how different we may be from each other, if we treat each other with respect, we can always be friends. Keep that in your heart. Keep that in your mind. And we will talk to you soon. We will talk to you tomorrow. Adios, amigos.